Hey everyone here from Tunnel Vision TV and in this tutorial I'm going to show you guys how to quickly and easily model a beer bottle in Maya 2017. Now you should be able to follow along if you're using previous versions of Maya. So first of all I'm going to go to the create tab here at the top and then I'm going to click on free image plane and then here on the side click on the little file or folder icon next to image name and then I'm going to browse to a beer bottle.jpg which is just an image of a beer bottle that I downloaded from Google and then I'm going to click on open. Alright, so then I'm going to move this image plane up slightly. So with it selected, press W on the keyboard and just move it up so that the bottle is sitting on the grid like that. And then with this image plane selected, I'm going to drop the alpha gain down just something like this so I can kind of see through it. And that's just going to make it easier when we're drawing our curves around it. Right, then I'm going to press space and then hover over the front view, pressing space again so we see this from the front. And I'm going to zoom in here just to the top like this. And then we're going to start drawing our curve around it. So right at the top, I'm going to click on the Curves and Surfaces tab. And then we're going to click on the Bezier tool. And then we're going to start drawing the curves. So I'm just going to start here on the right-hand side and just click and drag. And then I'm going to try and just match this uh, side of the bottle. Something like that. And I'm just going to go all the way around the side, going down like this. And then to the bottom around here. And then right to the center of it. And then I'm going to go back and uh, just draw the inside of the bottle. Now you don't have to be really precise with this, but I'm just going to go quickly around it, going up and uh, right to the top like that. Then I'm going to press Q on the keyboard, hold in shift and right click on the curve and then click on open close curves just to close down the curve. Right, then I'm going to go back into perspective view and uh, then I'm going to select my image plane, press H on the keyboard to hide it. And then I'm going to select the curve and then go to surfaces right here at the top. And then I'm going to click on the box next to revolve. All right, here I'm going to set my axis to Y. And then I'm going to increase the segments to 64 and click on apply. And then we can close this. So you can see this is our beer bottle. And um, because it's just showing black, it means it's actually reversed. So I'm going to highlight it go to surfaces and then click on reverse direction. All right, so there you can see we've got our curves bottle and uh, now I can go ahead and delete your Bezier curve. So I'm just gonna click on that in the outline and click on delete. Next, I wanna convert this to a polygon mesh. So I'm just gonna highlight the bottle, go to modify and then go to convert NURBS to polygons. Click on the little box next to it. Here I'm gonna click on quads and then click on count and set the count to 10,000. Click on apply. So that's the amount of polygons it's gonna create and then we can close this down. So now we can go ahead and delete the resolved surface one. Just click on delete and now we have our polygon uh, bottle. So really simple to do this. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick tutorial. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this one. And remember, I upload new tutorials on a weekly basis. So if you're into 3D or visual effects, please click on that subscribe button. Thanks a lot for watching. See you guys next time. Cheers. Bye.